What makes Plymouth State's Meteorology Program unique is that we are able to offer our undergraduate and graduate students a lot of different experiences that help them to achieve careers in just about any sector of meteorology. The Meteorology Program has embraced the cluster model over the last several years in which we've paired up with other majors across campus to help integrate our students to work on interdisciplinary projects. For example, the current NASA-funded Solar Eclipse Project is bringing together over six different majors onto eclipse ballooning teams. Uh, compared to big research universities, we're, uh, we're smaller. Uh, the students really get to know the faculty and the faculty get to know the students. Plymouth State has a small classroom feel with a large variety of opportunities and resources for us to thrive in. My experience here at PSU as a meteorology student has been great. Um, there's only 11 first year students, which has just been amazing. We're able to collaborate really well. Going to the faculty to ask for help and they have open door policies and that's, that's just been so helpful. I don't think I could have survived in a program where it was just a big competition. My experience studying meteorology at Plymouth State has been fantastic. I have enjoyed my time here so much. I have loved all my classes. I have loved all my professors. They've been really helpful with me inside the classroom and outside the classroom. We're up in the mountains. That's where I love to be. Um, PSU is just in a great location. Most people that like weather like being outdoors, right? So just being up in the mountains and being able to ski, rock climb, anything that you could ever want to do, um, and if you don't have that equipment, you can always go and rent it, which the school just makes very available to you. Plymouth State's location is in a great spot in New Hampshire. For success in our meteorology program, it gives us the chance to look at gigantic snowstorms. So Plymouth State has been able to help me professionally by providing me opportunities to work on these hard skills and soft skills. We have lots of hands-on experiences so that students can understand how weather instrumentation works. For example, we launch weather balloons. We have a TV studio. Anytime I want to go over to that broadcasting room and learn how to broadcast, I've done that with seniors and graduate students. They've taught me how to do that. There's just so many things that you can do hands-on if you want to. So as they're engaged to working and prepare a new generation of meteorologists. I believe Plymouth State has the perfect place for a broadcast meteorologist to learn, to grow, and to thrive in. Uh, we have the freedom to develop our own graphics. We have the opportunity to go on air at our news stations around for internships. And we also have the chance to do nightly newscasts for the Plymouth surrounding cable networks. I have been broadcasting to the local television here for about two years now. And it has been an awesome opportunity to be able to continually get better and get feedback from professors and mentors and alumni. I had the privilege to accept a chief meteorologist position in Savannah, Georgia at WTGS, proudly serve in Georgia and Southern South Carolina Monday through Friday. And with Oklahoma State's small community feel and large resources, I would not have gotten that position and Plymouth State University helped guide me to take in this first job.